Alright. It's at the 10 second mark now. Twenty seconds, fifteen, ten, five, and Chatelet, my Kekistani brothers and sisters. Today we'll be tackling the Grand Archives. Greg's already at the Dragon Slayer armor bonfire. He should probably start heading over towards uh, the next bonfire. Titanite chunk. I forgot about that. Just remember if you go to the right, there's a Titanite chunk down those little stair things before you go up towards the next bonfire. I bet you are. We fucking ate that giant ass dinner. And before I continue, I will say happy Memorial Day to everyone out there. And uh, may you have a somber day of remembrance of all the lives uh, given and taken over all these wars, at least here in America. Oh shit. I can't drop my sign. Oh wait, the Grand Archives door isn't open yet. I want you to want to bet as soon as I open this door I'm going to be able to use my fucking sign. Yep. It also makes me able to be invaded, so my sign is down by the bonfire now. I'm gonna rest at the bonfire. Let me know when you got me, make sure the password's on. Make sure you're part of the way of blue. See, I think what I'm gonna probably have to do is have you invade someone's world. And then I'm going to have to sit in that same area as a way of blue. Or not way of blue, uh, dark moon. And then you could probably just help me take out some uh, Aldrich Faithful. And for every Aldrich Faithful that's downed, I get another uh, proof of Concord kept. It's like after every single invader kill, you get a proof of Concord kept. All right. Hang on. I wanted to show you this shit real quick. I mean, look at this goddamn one reset real quick. This shit's fucking badass looking. Motherfuckers over here countless goddamn foot. Alright, hang on before we continue. He has a wing knight. Wing knight. Ah. Hell leggings. Alright, let me, uh. Tears up. Okay, let's go. First things first, we got this fucking. Uh. Crystal Sage wannabe right here. You fucking did the twisted fingers, dude. Why would you do that? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna just start heading towards the next area. Killing these freaking, um, slave thralls. I don't know. Here, follow me. I know where I'm going, I swear. Alright, I'm going to 
get this guy right in front of us. Dunk your head, dude. Dunk your head. It makes those cursed fingers not work. The ones that come out of the walls and shit. And, uh... Can, can, yeah, it makes it to where you don't get cursed by them. That and it makes you look like a badass with a goddamn wax on your head. And it doesn't mess with your, uh... What's it called? With the armor from your helm, either. But yeah, it keeps you from being able to be cursed by this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, as long as that watch is on your head, that uh, those cursed fingers don't fuck with you. All right, you need to kick down this ladder right here. Whenever you show up, right here where I'm standing. Kick down that ladder. All right, and we come this way. Now their asses are just going all over the place. Um, there's an item, or wait, no, pull this lever right here. All right, and then we come this way. And we go up this way. Fucking Crystal Sage. Dead. Get your crystal scroll. Fucking fire bombs and shit. Making my uh, frame rate drop horribly. Eat shit, little guy. Oh, thank you. Okay, come this way. Before the, uh, the wax wears off. Roll into this wall. Alright, fight this boreal knight with me. Alright, he's down. Gather up what he dropped. Come over here. I think there's another item on this body. Sorry, I know you already have that one. Alright, come with us. We're going to kick down all the shortcut ladders and everything because before you fight Lothric and Lorien, you're more than likely going to have to... Uh, wait, this way. We're more than likely going to have to turn in the, the crystal scroll. And then before we continue, there's another lever right here. Greg, come back. Right here. This lever. And it looks like they're out here fighting. Yeah. Come gather up your free item. Oh, and then up by the, uh, where we come out, where the Dragon Slayer armor uh, bonfire is. You know, like when we come down from that area on the elevator next to the Lothric and Lorien boss room. Here, Greg. You got to come down and trigger this. Then you open up the door. Just go down and trigger it and open up the door. There's a lever. I'm going to continue going forward. My wax wore off. God damn it. Oh my god. They are being so loud right now. They're just horsing around in Chuck's room. But it's like. So loud. Alright. This is a normal chest. You'll see the item when you show up. Fucking A. See, I don't have the wax on my head, so I can't just run in there. 
Like I was. Okay. Where's my throwable items? Thank you, sir. Oh, seriously? His ass got so far away. Run back, Greg. You're going to wind up getting cursed. All right, there's an item right over here. All right, then we... Starting at what? Nice. How many? All right, you got that spot open for the silver cat ring? Because we're going to be redoing a small portion of this in a second. No, not right this second. Hang on, let's fight these stupid gargoyles. There he is. Alright, that guy's down. Grab the item. Silver cat ring on. My silver cat ring is now on. All right, we gotta come down here in order for you to get the gray rat's ashes. So come down here. The fucking corvians are everywhere, so watch out. Oh shit, I'm out of fucking the blue stuff. there all right I think they meant like they're over here do you see any items or anything down here no 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 that's the one that you drop down you can do that shit pretty much anytime but it should be down here the thing for gray rats ashes you don't see it anywhere down here All right, and you don't. Yeah, just look around on this rooftop real quick. See if you see any items. If not, I'm gonna have a. I'm gonna look at a video location then. So give me one second, so that way I can go to YouTube. Oh, you found them? playing right now. I have a stupid unskippable ad. Oh my god. Come on. This guy's really gonna sit here and try to do a fucking super long video about this shit. My ass is gonna be skipping it. Skip a little further ahead. Spiders are optional. Boom. Down. Run this way. Hang on, I'm not even over by you. Rooftops. Over this little rooftop. You want to go to the end, and I'll show you why in a second. There's that guy there. Don't worry about him. He's harmless. You're going to want to go right here. Because if you look to the right, you're going to see some baddies. There they are. But don't worry about them. We don't need them. But you do want to S this up just in case. And then go over here. Nope, not over there. That's death. You want to go this way to the other guy's death. And there's our little corpse. There's a gray rat. And as you can see, I've already got his ashes, but they'll be right on top. Oh, yeah, I they're see it. You were right. 
Come on. back to where you were. So what do we do? We toast. Where are you at? How far forward did you go? Oh, there you are. Remember that spot that you were looking at? You're like, I see an item over there. Yeah, you have to jump to it. You have to jump. And land, and land on the rooftop right here. Right here. And then Gray Rat is literally right here. And then there's another item over here. And then you get down on this rooftop. Oh, my God. The other summons are probably getting pissed off. They probably cleared up all the way to the goddamn Grand Archives, uh, top shit. Come over here. Grab this. And this way. Yeah, make sure you roll. If you think you're gonna fall. Up the ladder right here. It's all good. Then we can come this way. I'm running back towards the um the top. Uh, just go up the ladder that's out there on the balcony. Stick to the left side. Uh huh. You yeah, on that little bridge thing. And just keep going. Well, I had to make sure I slowed down enough for you. Now I'm going to switch my shit. Where is it? To that. Now I have extra defense up until when we reach the last thing. Because like I said, you're probably going to want to send them home. So that way we can get me through this area. And you can turn in the crystal scroll by the crystals. Uh, the crystal. Oh no, no, no. Wait until after we trigger that top elevator. Oh, are you serious? I accidentally kicked the goddamn... You just fall. Yeah. Fucking gargoyles, I swear to God. I hate these fucking things. Alright, he's down. Alright, and then we come up this way. And then this rooftop. Because this is how you get over here. There's two more gargoyles. Looks like their asses just ran on through. Alright, number two. Oh, bullshit. He changed his fucking flight pattern like three goddamn times doing that. That fucking wing shield. Alright, he's dead. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's another reason I want us to fucking send them home after we trigger that last uh, thing so that way we can get uh, all of our Estes back before fighting the stupid boss. Alright, there... Yeah, the Wayne Knights are up there if you decide to go that one way. Kick down this ladder right here. We don't have to go do the Wayne Knights. You know that, right? Right there, go back a bit. Right here. Yeah, I can't kick it down. You gotta do it. And then as soon as we go out here is where all those NPCs are. Mm. 
That's wishful thinking. It looks like it. Looks like they're already headed towards the fucking boss gate. I'm real, I feel sorry for them. Because this is where the fucking elevator is. And you need to turn that crystal scroll in. Buy the magics. And all that shit. Before we, uh... Yeah, come on. Elevator. Yeah, you gotta trigger it, because... It hasn't been triggered before. Well, you did use the twisted fingers like... In kind of an idiot move. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, send my ass home, then I'm gonna bring you into my world. We're gonna do the same shit. Only this time, it's just gonna be me and you. Maybe a third person. A third person is possible. Yeah, and I heard you put on the password, so that's good. Yeah, I heard you put on the password. So that's why I can hear fucking everything echoed. Alright. I just showed up in my own world wearing the goddamn wax thing on my head. Oh shit, I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to use the fucking twisted fingers. Hang on, I have to reload this bonfire. Oh. Mm. Before I summon you in, go to Firelink, give him the crystal scroll, buy the crystal shit. See, a fucking deep protection to cancel out my fucking, uh, Tears of Denial, like, you just use that, but, I mean, that's bullshit. I can't believe, like, you can't stack buffs on top of Tears of Denial, unless you use something like fucking, uh, Sacred Oath, which fucking, like, it uses 65 fucking focus points to use Sacred Oath, 100 focus points to do Tears of Denial. And every time we do Soothing Sunlight, that's another 80s focus points. Shit is fucking crazy. Yeah, once you give her Grave Rat's Ashes, you'll be able to buy unlimited amounts of splintering bolts and exploding bolts, along with everything else Grave Rat sold at the prices he sold it at. So, you know how, like, each one of her normal fire bombs is 100? Because Grave Rat sold them at 50, her fire bombs are now 50. And I say, since we did all this bullshit to help Grave Rat and all that shit, we should probably stock up on the really cheap shit. Right, I usually get almost up to max inside my uh, storage box. And I haven't done that in a while because I've been like just accruing souls and letting that shit get higher and higher and higher. I'm almost at 5 million if not already. And I've just been sitting here fucking going through the game. 
And it's all because I'm not leveling right now. And I stick by it. <laughs> All right, you already bought all the uh, shit off of him. Use the twisted coiled sword fragment um, to reload Firelink, basically. Like, you pick the shrine bonfire, it takes you back there, then talk to Yuria. Turn what off? Yuria, the dark chick. Not Carla. Uh, the chick that sells you the dark hand. She should have different dialogue talking about how she wants the ashes of Ornbeck. I'm going to look up the Morian Blade real quick. The usur uh, uh, usurping the fire, is that what she's talking about? Alright, I'm loading up the page for the Morian Blade right now. Did you look at the messages I sent you? Yeah. Well, yeah, that all that is for the ending we're doing, and we've almost done everything on it. Um. Yeah, I'm good. Hang on. Oh, he's probably enthralled by it. Considering how much he heard me play it while he was in the womb. God damn it, which one is it? I'm still here. Don't worry. Huh? 
No, dude, Henri's dead. She's the chick that you stuck the sword through her face. Yeah, no, never mind. You don't have to talk to Yuria. We should already have the quest line because uh, uh, you talked to her right after um, you gave him the first scroll and bought the uh, the spells off of him. So yeah, you, you should already be set up for it once you give him the crystal scroll. Make sure to exhaust his dialogue and then he should be disappear from Firelink. Yeah, his ashes are going to be up there on that top level because his ashes is going to be dead. He going the same route as Grey Rat. <clears throat> Alright, head back to the Grand Archive's first bonfire so that way we can continue this stream. Your sign's done alright. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, I just heard it pop. Your sign. Um. Shit, I'm just gonna put on lightning arrow. So that way you don't have to, uh. What's it called? So that way I can do lightning damage and have a long distance weapon without having to worry about the stupid, uh crossbows and shit. I think this is one of the ones that you just had, so I'm gonna... I, yeah, I'm just gonna keep it just you and me. We do not have to fight the Boreal Knight this time. Because I already did that shit. So, put on your Tears of Denial. I'm gonna put on Sacred Oath. You ready? I'm gonna come in here. Oh, that chicken shit little bitch. Okay, follow me. I think it's this way, and then there's. There we go. I knew that other fucker was going to draw up. And then I get this item here. No, Greg, follow. You don't know where to go. Okay, Greg, come back this way. I'm going to come up here real quick, Greg, right this item. He could have continued forward. It, oh, yeah, after I stagger lock him into a corner, you go in there and hit him a few times. You're the best. <laughs> And then there's this item over here. Wait, Greg, come back. I'm going over this way real quick. Night chunk. Ah, uh, the crystal chime. I'm going to give you this one. Not the one I'm using, but, you know, this one. The one I just picked up. Because the crystal chime is fucking badass. That's the one I was telling you that can do miracles and sorceries. Make sure you dip your head in the wax. You know that thing's on a time limit, right? The wax. Alright. I was just going to say, uh, you know, the best thing you could do is make sure that's a fresh dip. Oh, 
Wait, no, there's a lever up on top of that. Wait, there's a lever. Oh, power within. And the witch's locks. Isn't there an item on top of this staircase thing? Oh wait, no, it's a crystal lizard and you already got it. I will head back to the bonfire. No, it's up. Well, no, most of the ladder to go back towards where we were. What, did you go after the Crystal Sage by yourself? Yeah, I'm going, I'm almost back at the bonfire already. Once you kick down this ladder, it's like a one-two skidoo back to the bonfire. So put your sign down, say it's the bonfire. Alright, your sign's down. Oh, of course the crystal fucking sage is up there shooting fucking magic at me. I don't see your sign yet. Oh, I see it. I see it. Yeah, I got it. I'm already headed back in. Alright, what's fucking shooting? I hear somebody trying to shoot. Uh huh. Alright. When you come in, go straight up the staircase in front of you and then turn right, and there's a ladder that goes up. Take that ladder. Pull this lever. Hear that asshole. Yeah. Oh my god, no you don't. Oh my god, this f ooh. No, it's okay. It's that fucking crystal sage. Dump your head. That way those assholes can't touch us like that. That's a no-no area. Your ass dead. Come on, really? Oh, I guess I am one-handing. Alright, I'm gonna drop right here. Grab this item. And then I'm gonna continue. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go fight this fucking Crystal Sage. Because this ass... Done piss me off for the last goddamn time. Where'd he go? Oh, I guess he disappeared because he got close. Alright, just run. Follow me. This way. And he's dead. Crystal scroll, please. Thank you. Okay. Now I need to open this lever right here. Which pulls down this bookcase right here. Or... Yeah, but they, look. Come back to where I was. Remember that bridge? Cross the bridge and go back to... uh here no come back I'm going to show you what that thing opened because I know you didn't go in and grab the item no Greg back you're going too far forward the ring that you missed the last two playthroughs 
Hang on, because I have two of them now, so it'll be easy for me to tell. It is the priestess ring. Oh, no, it's the scholar ring. So you did pick it up. All right, good. Because your ass missed it the last two playthroughs. All right, let's get on this elevator. All right, here, I'll go do it. Yeah, just wait there for me. Then I'm gonna pull this lever and I'm just gonna run back up onto the elevator. And I'm pretty sure there's another lever I have to pull before we get to the very, very top where the last elevator's at. I'm not 100% sure though. I'll figure it out as we go along. Okay, I usually like to use these black fire bombs for these assholes. Oh wait, what am I saying? I got wax. Yeah, Greg, just... Oh, what the fuck happened to my wax? Seriously? My wax just disappeared. Like, it was nothing. I guess they're, the hands here are so fucking powerful, they don't give a fuck. They're like, catch these, motherfucker. Catch these hands, catch them. All right, I'm gonna have to wait for my curse to go down real quick and then I'm gonna try to mad dash for what I think is a fucking Titan Knight scale. Flesh white ring, God damn it. All righty. Tons of curse damage, isn't that so fun? All right, this way. Gonna use one of these, one of these. And we don't need to go down and fight that guy unless you uh, really, 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 really want to. I'm going to switch to the silver cat ring real quick. You need it. Oh, I see. So I just had to have me come down here and fight all these fuckers myself. Before I grab Grey Rat's ashes, I'm going to go back as far as I can without jumping down. Because I think there is another item over here. Yes. And then that's where that fucking stupid knight is. I'm going to firebomb him to get us the souls. I killed the red-eyed knight. And he dropped an item, but fuck it. It's probably just another piece of the Lothic knight armor set. An armor set I already fucking have. I don't get this, though. Why can you walk all the way out here if there's no fucking item? It like, makes no sense unless he jumped too far from the area up there. But, um, yeah, hang on, I'm headed back towards you. You could jump over to where Grey Rat's ashes are if you want. Alright, here we go, I'm passing you. I will go resummon you. Actually, I think, oh, no, there is no next bonfire. That's the whole thing. Yeah, the boss is next. I don't know, just go to the Grand Archives bonfire. I'm already right here at the ladder. Why, this gigantic fucking ladder. All right. 
and then uh, we can take the elevator back up. Cause I have that elevator that goes almost all the way up. Oh, there's your sign. I need steel protection just to make sure. Um, all right, this way. Do what you need to do. Just this time, you're going to want to make an immediate right before you go up those first set of stairs. Dude, I haven't gotten up to past the NPCs. Yeah, I still have to trigger the last uh, elevator. Follow me? Right here. And then I'm going to trigger the... Oh, wait, it's already... Wait, no, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Sorry. It, every time I see the fucking gate around it, I'm thinking the fucking uh, things there. And your ass going by my word. Fucking about to walk off the goddamn edge, fucking Wiley Coyote style. Um, alright. Come this way, Greg. This shit almost took off with you in it. No, there's still enemies. Just follow me. We gotta go fight uh, three more of them gargoyles before we can make it around the top portion of the room we were just in. Cause I don't really wanna fucking run past them like a pussy. Thank you, sir. Oh, shit. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. He's dead. As soon as you hear that chink sound, he's, they're dead. It's the same sound it makes when you die. Yeah, hang on, hang on, hang on. Stay here. God damn, I hate when they do this shit. It's like they want. Oh shit, they're both here. They're both here. I was about to say, this fuck is taking so much goddamn damage. Gargoyle flame hammer. All right. I think there's another item over here, isn't there? Yeah, no. What about on the outside edge of this roof? Isn't there an item all the way over here? Nope. Yeah, dude, you, you do notice that these giant windows, the one that we just walked through, do they look familiar to you at all? The Ring City, Drag Heat? The one you go through sideways? Alright, now we got all these stupid NPCs to fight. 
You already out there? No. I, I, I'm staying with you. Hang on. Damn. Damn, he smacked your ass hard. He left an imprint on that shit. Oh, come on. I was about to say. Alright. Thank you, sir. Okay, if I come over here. Double smash. Thank you, sir. All right, that was a tight night chunk. And that's everything that's up here. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, I throw a trigger the elevator and we and they start heading down it or whatever. That's when uh, I'm gonna send you home and I'm gonna go get the crystal shit. Okay, there's the NPCs. All right, and we'll come grab this item. No, they all trigger at once. Once one is triggered, they all trigger. Go ahead. What the fuck is that damage? What the hell? Well, yeah, if I'm getting stagger locked, I'm probably gonna... Holy shit, that axe does so much fucking damage. Oh, he's using Warcry. He's using... Sage's crystal staff, already have it. And uh, I buy the stuff. I sent you home because I went down the elevator. Yeah, I'm going to the, uh, well, I'm all set up once we fight Lothric and Lorien in both our worlds. We pick up Orinbeck's ashes and give them to uh, to Yuria, and she'll give you the Morian blade. Just remember, uh, as soon as we beat Lothric and Lorien, he will be. A, you can get his ashes from inside the Grand Archives from the area I should have pointed out to you. And then you give them to uh, Yuria, and she'll give you the Morian blade. It's a stronger version of the Red Tear Stone Ring. So yeah, your health needs to be below 20%. But it also boosts your shit like no other. Yeah, no, I just... uh. I just got the last of the sorceries. Now I got crystal magic weapon. Fuck yes. I'm going to give the Shrine Handmaiden Grey Rat's Ashes and buy some bolts real quick. Alright, Brittany. Later, Brittany. I'm said bye. The Tom. I already know she says bye. <laughs> um, I already have all these, right? Yeah. Just gonna buy a hundred of each. That's one round, ninety-nine volts each. Oh, amount of sniper volts too. And fuck the standard volts. Um, I think that's actually everything for arrows. 
and then yeah her fire bombs are cheap as fuck now um I think that's everything I need from her I am going back to the Grand Archives I'm gonna put my sign down you're gonna summon me in we're gonna go up that elevator and fight Lothric and Lorien You should also be able to summon in Ornbeck. So his ass will come in with all them sorceries and shit. I mean, hell, we've done enough for the fucking side quest lines to, uh, to qualify for, like, so many of the NPC summons. It's not even funny. Like, had we not did the Rosario's Finger thing... At the very end, oh no, I said if we had not, at the very end, when we face the Soul of Cinder, it would be Uria, Pale Shade of Londor, uh, Cirrus, and I think there's one other person that you could summon in there. Either way, you know, doesn't matter at this point because we're going to summon in probably Uria, and if we use the Twisted Fingers, you can summon in uh, Pale Shade. Huh? Um, PJ said, Come here, Daddy. Uh, can we finish this real quick? Can Mandy handle it real quick? Cause we're in the middle of a stream. No, cause we're on stream. We got the boss battle left. If she can wait 15 minutes. And TJ will be fine. <laughs> no, no he, there's been times where we've had to have him sit there in a slight poopy before. Because... Let him finish. Well, yeah, because, like, when he's eating, we let him fucking finish eating before we change his diaper. Unless he's been feeding for, like, an hour. Because it's usually about the 45 minute to hour mark where the... The, um bile in their stomachs can make it uh or the bile in their poo can actually make uh, the diaper rash appear pretty sure we go out this side yeah <sighs> gonna sit my happy ass down actually no I'm gonna go fight motherfuckers Ready or not, here I come, assholes. Where's all the assholes? Oh, wait, I see them. Oh, fuck you. That fucking roll catch on some of these fucking things pissing me off. Okay, the fucking knights are gonna be headed down towards us in a second. Head back, head back. Oh, Greg, really? No. No, you're gonna summon me in right there where you're gonna spawn in at the bonfire. Because that's where my ass is gonna be when I come back into my world. It's right there by the bonfire. Alright, my sign is down. My butt is at the bonfire. Where the hell are my 
Yeah, they're all the way up top. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to put on uh, Great Soul Dregs because Lothric, or not Lothric, Lorien, is weak against Dark. So when he's doing his little fucking, I'm going to try to heal uh, Loth or Lorien back up. The one that crawls. <laughs> Whichever one crawls is the one that's weak against lightning, and then the other one's weak against dark. So I'm going to go in with my Dragon Slayer Great Axe on the, uh, the main threat here. And then when it's time, I'm going to switch up, use my Great Soul Dregs to try to do some massive damage. Yeah, I was about to say, what the fuck you doing? I'm over here in the elevator waiting for you. Alright, yeah, the Lorian, the Elder Prince, is weak to lightning, frost, and magic. Hey, I'll tell you. Lothric's weakness. I'm pretty sure it's dark, though. Oh, wait, no. His weakness are lightning, frost, bleed... Slash, thrust, and... Oh, wait. No, that's showing for both of them. He's weak against bleed. Oh, uh, okay. That doesn't mean anything. Oh, shit. Well, I'm looking up the fucking uh, weaknesses over here. I know your ass had already triggered the goddamn elevator. Here we go. We're back up the elevator. Alright, let's just... Here. I'm going to have to switch this to the crystal chime. I'm going to put on my uh, tears real quick. And yeah, no I'll save Sacred Oath. Sacred Oath is uh, not needed here yet. I just figured it'd help us get through these assholes a little bit quicker. Do what you need to. Watch your back. I was about to say, how'd that fucker survive? Alright, hang on, hang on. Alright, you go on ahead. Oh, what? That should have been a perfect fucking grab right there. Well, your ass is on him. I figured I'd let you get the kill, but fuck me anyway. <laughs> All right, open this door, take a look around, make sure there's no, uh, you should be able to see the summon signs even without the password on or off. Because the NPC summons, uh, the password doesn't mean shit to them. Okay, do you see the signs in here, or out here? No. Well, keep an eye as you walk up towards this. Make sure you look behind the doors here. As you walk up towards these doors. There you go.
Ornbeck of Venheim. That way he can fight with us against the final boss. Or the final Lord of Cinder, I should say. Alright, come this way. Let's just hope his dumbass uh, follows us up here close enough for tears, or not tears, for Sacred Oath to uh, be effective. Alright, just tell me when you're ready, and I'll let go of uh, Sacred Oath. Fucking Greg's monkey looking ass. Yeah, you had to change that helm, huh? Had to change that helm looking like fucking Monkey Man from goddamn uh, Planet of the Apes over here. Alright, here we go. Oh yeah, he's gonna try his best to kick your ass. Thank you, sir. I have no clue, but I'm going to use uh, a green blossom to up my stamina regen. Got him. And he's down. Here comes phase two. my brother for that is our curse he sounds like completely disinterested oh dear brother I'm on my way I think it's funny though. Lothric's prince is Lothric. Like it makes sense if it was a family name, but he goes by Lothric and the other one goes by Lorien. All right, are you ready to go ham on his ass? Better get off your phone because the cutscene's about to end. Yeah, his ass going to fucking ham on us. I'm going to heal real quick. There, I got you. That's right, he's not weak against dark shit. He's resistant, but not weak. Okay, god damn it. I hate that Wrath of the God shit he pulls right at the end, too. Alright, I'm going to come in for the jumping R2. Oh, shit. Roll away. Oh, come on. No, it's good, it's good, it's good. Focus on the... Uh, focus on his ass. Mr. wants to teleport and do massive damage with a fucking cheap teleport swing. Alright. There he goes. He's down. The twin princes are down. And now we do them on mine. And we have finished the Lords of Cinder.
Yeah, I might as well put this on real quick, even though I don't really need the soles. And then I'm going to switch my helm back. And you're going to go from that bonfire to the, uh, the beginning bonfire at the Grand Archives. Um, unless if you want, you could go pick up Ornbix ashes real quick. I can't come with you. Uh, all right, put your sign down. I'll summon you in. Okay, he's not weak against dark. He's weak against bleed. All right, as soon as I see your sign pop, I'll pick you up. And I guess every and when I hear it pop, I should say. That's got some good bleed damage. Ah, oh, that's poison though. He's resistant to poison. Chaos Blade, isn't that the one that... Yeah. Pontiff Knight Wraith Scythe has frost damage, I believe. Um. That causes bleeding. That causes bleeding. Yeah, I'm just looking for a good bleed weapon. I mean, it doesn't have to be super strong. Um... All right, looks like, um, make sure your sign has the password on. Because I haven't heard it pop yet. Yeah, it's still not here. All right, as soon as I see it pop, I'll get up from the bonfire and trigger you, bring you in here. Um, did I get a second hawk ring? White ring, wolf ring, nope, hawk ring, neo ring. Oh, there's a sign. Alright, I just used Tears of Denial. I just summoned you in. I'm going to make sure my elevator's down. My elevator is down. Alright, I'm ready. All right, you there? Okay, on to the elevator. You're gonna trigger it once you run in behind me. Pretty sure the opening's on this side, right? It's the opposite side of the one you go in, yeah. All right, yeah, I'm just gonna go two-handed ham on these fuckers up here.
Oh, I swear to God, I always go for the long swing and wind up missing. Okay. These cocksuckers with the goddamn arrows. And then there's this cocksucker. And then these fuckers with the shields. Alright, and then we go up here. Mr. Knight here. And that's how you spank that cocksucker like that. Don't tell me you're about to die. Thank you, sir. All right. Invasion. Right here. Oh, fuck. He's using the fucking, uh... Hang on, let me open this fucking door. Fuck the pyromancy at the end for right now. Focus more on this asshole. Got him. Point down. Vertible shackle I don't need anymore. Um, shit, where's the summon sign for him again? Isn't it out here? The left ear. Yeah. I'm going to use the Twisted Fingers just in case. If we get invaded, we'll just fucking take our happy asses right through the goddamn boss gate and say, See ya! Um, I don't see Ornbeck's fucking summon sign. You gave him the first phone, you adopted his dialogue? Yep. And he said he was leaving Firelink. No, but that shouldn't matter because he's an NPC. Hang on, I'll take the password off just in case. That'd be really weird, though, if he's the one NPC you have to have the password off for. Yeah, no, his summon sign is not on showing up on mine. That's really, really weird. Because I know I finished his shit. I know I bought all of his spells. And I know he said he was leaving Firelink. So I know I did all that right. Um, fuck it. Come over here. See how ass always be getting fucking phone calls when we're uh, about to play. They, it's only because they know that y'all ass fucking talking to me. There ain't no holding on. We got two more summons now. Alright, where's this other fucking guy? I summoned him in like right fucking after. Okay, fuck it. Guy does not get a buff. Oh, and there he goes. And yes, we are watching the uh, cutscene.
And then right after this, we're going to do the soul ascender. Right, there's no more optional bosses. That's right, no more, uh, no more optional bosses. We've done them all. And then, uh, the Ring City. After the Soul Ascender. I hate that fucking sword so much. Where's the other fucking summons? I think they fucking went home or some shit. Dude, it's only me and you. It's not showing their health bars at all. Well, fuck them anyhow. I'm gonna roll away, because I gotta heal. I'm gonna give myself full strength. Hang on. No, it's good. It's good. It's good. Heal yourself. Heal yourself. This motherfucker just stood up. Oh, shit. Yeah, watch out for that. Hang on. I gotta use some blue. Wait, Greg! You rolled right out of it. Here, heal yourself. There you go, you're healed. Alright, and then we gotta deal with these fuckers together. Alright, I'm gonna start using my fucking bleed magic. Although I think my luck would have to be up a little bit more to, um... to do more bleed damage. I love how the lips barely fucking move. And even when they move, it's not like they're talking. It's like they're going... This is a fucking PS4 game. This is a 2016 PS4 game. And the lips don't fucking move. They don't move on the NPCs either. Like, if you ever look closely at an NPC's face while you're doing the, uh... Woo! No, you don't! Oh, shit. I think... Yeah, my, my tears is going. My tears is going. Shit, I need to use the blue. Stay close. Stay close. Oh, that was some bullshit. Oh my god, he's about to take my ass out. I can't believe it. I cannot believe that. Yeah, my ass is about to get fucking taken out. I'm his, like, number one focus right now, and he keeps teleporting to hit me. Oh... I guess I could use the sword. Shit, teleport. Fucking cocksucker. Every time I go to use a goddamn spell. Yeah, after this boss is beat. Just like I said I was gonna do. 
No, you ain't, because if I die, we need to finish the stream, nigga. <laughs> I'm about to die. And there goes my tears. And I'm dead. I'm dead. He caught me with that fucking holy knight sword shit. You know that cheap move that people like to use in PvP with the fucking twin knight, uh, twin prince's great sword. Yeah, sit your ass back down because we're about to finish this boss. Greg. I swear to God, if his ass actually went out for a goddamn cigarette, we're in the middle of a fucking stream. Oh my god, his ass actually went out for a fucking cigarette when we're on stream. Yeah, dude, all we have to do is beat this boss and we're good. Ember's restored, I'm just waiting on, uh... Your sign to pop. I have to put the password on again. Alright. Password's on, just waiting for your sign to pop. As soon as I see it, oh my god, how do I not have enough intelligence for Crystal Soul Spear? Son of a bitch. As soon as I see it, I'll summon you in. Oh, I just heard it pop. Alright. Summoning you in. Pulling the lever. Tears of Denial. They got these stupid black fire bombs. All right. This time we're just gonna run past all those stupid enemies. So that way we can get in there, get the fucking boss beat, not have to worry about healing and shit. Greg. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> See your ass all up in that goddamn phone. We're running past the enemies and we're just going through the boss gate. So that way we're not wasting all of our shit. Just remember to start rolling when you start hearing arrows and shit. Yeah, I know I gotta go first, but you still gotta keep up with my ass. Of course there's a fucking holier than thou knight right in front of me. Well, I gotta heal. Here we go. Yeah, that fucking instant teleport shit. I like guess the first fucking move he does. I didn't even have enough time for... Ooh! That fucking cheap ass shit. Right, I'm gonna get as close as I can without getting myself compromised. 
All right, watch out. Fucking A. Yeah, he about killed you in one shot with that. Okay, that r last roll catch was some bullshit. Okay, I walked in that one. Really? This motherfucker really just teleported out of the way of my shit. Okay, no. No, I got. I need to heal. He just knocked off my fucking tears of denial. I, I need to speed heal once I fucking... Alright. Fuck it. I'm gonna skip it. Dude, I need to heal. Like, my ass is about fucking dead. Like, I had one HP, no tears. Shit, I need to put my tears on. Shit, watch out for those fucking... I hate those fucking things so... Oh, get him! Get him, R1! You had him! Oh my god! Oh, oh my god. Heal, heal, heal. Alright, I need to use blue. And his ass going ham on you. Oh my god, no! Thank you. Roll. Oh, we got his ass. <laughs> Fucking Lothic, I guess, took the last brunt of the hit. Alrighty. So before I end this run through, I'm going to run back to the Grand Archives. I'm going to grab Warnbeck's Ashes. And I'm going to get the Morian Blade. So, yeah, I'm going to have to probably go through with few different dips in the fucking Grand Archives. And if his ashes aren't there, I'm going to be fucking livid because I followed that shit to basically a T. I talked to that bitch after every fucking boss battle, after every new fucking area. That bitch better give me my goddamn uh, attack sword. Because, like, you can superpower yourself by using two Morian Blades and the Red Tearstone Ring. Like, if you're using Affinity, you could have a Morian Blade in each hand on top of the Red Tearstone Ring and the, um, the Dark Clutch Ring. Um, and then you use the, the one that boosts uh, Sorceries. So I believe Affinity is a sorcery. And then when you use all that shit together, you cast Affinity and then put on the second Morian Blade. And it does a fuck ton of damage. That's what that one guy was doing. And why it was like one-shotting people. Where the fuck are on back ass? Alright, go smoke your cigarette. Go do what you need to do. I'm trying to find my goddamn, uh, the ashes of Warnbeck here. His ashes should be up here.
I don't know if they're supposed to be up here, up here, or what. But from what they described, this is the exact area where Ornbeck's ashes are supposed to be. And I do not see a fucking item. think so little things I don't see his ashes up here and I swear to God if I somehow quote unquote failed that side quest I'm gonna be pissed How was that? I mean, they said it's supposed to be near the top level of the fucking Grand Archives. see an item anywhere I swear on everything if his ass is still in fucking fire link I just saying he was leaving yeah fuck that you know what? I'm gonna use the fucking coiled sword. Go to the shrine bonfire. I'm gonna go look around that fucking corner. And if his ass is still standing there, I'm gonna flip. I'm gonna fucking flip. If he's still standing there, I'm gonna kill his ass. And I better get his fucking ashes. No, he's gone. And is this chick still saying the same shit? Yeah, she's still saying the same shit. Alright, well, I guess I'm going to have to look it up and see where his ashes might be. So, Shadowlay, my Kekistani brothers and sisters, and I want you to watch the next episode of Greg and Zard play Dark Souls 3 New Game Plus 2. The next one will be the Soul Ascender. And then after that will be the entirety of the Ring City. Whether we break it up into two parts where the Drag Heap and the Ring City are two separate videos or not, all depends on how fast we can get through it. Either way, we're going to have some fun. So, Chatelet, I hope you have a good one. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.